And he's gone. Caught an extra cover. So Gomes is out. Caught by Border. Off Yardley for 43. And the West Indies are 179 for four. Well, he wasn't really going after him. He just stroked it gently to short cover and Border took a straightforward catch. And Gomes is out for 43. And it's three, four for 179. Yardley to Lloyd. And uh, there's no one better to take a catch like that than Kim Hughes of his West Australian bowling partner. And that was well bowled by Yardley. David Moreir threw it a bit further outside of Stump and Lloyd has gone. That is a blow for the West Indies. Yes, Clive Lloyd looking to push things along there. Getting one out in the rough. Gets the outside edge and Kim Hughes takes a simple catch at backward point. The West Indian captain is on his way with a total at 5 for 208. Yardley to David Murray. Catch it! And that's gone. Murray is out. Yardley strikes again. Good catch by Laird. And Murray goes for one. And the West Indies now lose their sixth wicket for 225. Well, Bruce Yardley in his 21st over today and flight it up well. Bit of bat and pad, and that's where he should have bowled all day at those stumps. A good diving catch by Bruce Laird. Just had to move to his left. Third wicket for Bruce Yardley. David Murray on his way back to the pavilion, and the West Indies 6 for 225. Bruce Yardley bowls to Michael Holding. And that's high in the air. Under it there is Dyson and it's a long way up and he takes the catch. Well, Yardley's fourth wicket, he's done it again. Gave it plenty of flight and John Dyson looking up at that sky, he had a long time to wait. Always a difficult catch to take. Had to move to his left. We just pointed out that there were two men deep. Michael Holding took them both on, hit it well. But hit it a little bit too high and Dyson had plenty of time to consider what he was going to do took it right up over the eyes and that was a good catch by Dyson and that's the end of Michael Holding Yardley's fourth wicket so the West Indies now 7 for 231 Bruce Yardley now to Sylvester Clark and if you thought Dyson's last catch was well judged just have a look at this in the air, it's going out towards Dyson, he's running back, he's under it, what a great catch, gosh, that's one of the best outfield catches you will ever see, John Dyson, a tremendous performance. Yes, he was uh, in a little bit too far for a start, may have misjudged it or perhaps uh, had a problem picking it up, but then in the last fraction of a second, took a tremendous leap into the air and pulled in an absolute blinder. A very delighted bowler rushes out to congratulate him. And uh, that was a gigantic hit from the big fast bowler. And there, and probably the advantage that John Dyson has got, he used to be a soccer goalkeeper. And didn't he just look like a soccer goalkeeper as he went through the air to pull in an absolute blinder? And uh, he thinks it's worth a rest after taking a catch like that. Sylvester Clark on his way back. Yardley's got five. And the West Indies are 8 for 2.46. Yardley to Jeff Dujon. Catch! He's got him! What a catch! What a match for Bruce Yardley! Caught and bowled for 48. You can't keep Bruce Yardley out of this game this summer. Tremendous performance. Fight at that ball. Dujon wasn't to the pitch. And Yardley did the rest. 4.40 this is succession for Jeff Dujon. That's how the fourth one ended. Brilliant diving effort there from Bruce Yardley and a very annoyed batsman, but a delighted uh, bowler. Good piece of flight there. Just uh, spinning that one over the top, dropping that one on him rather than curving it away from him and then diving forward to take a brilliant catch. Jeffrey Dujon, Dujon out for 48 and the West Indies are 9 for 255. Bruce Yardley to Ghana. And Yardley finishes off this very courageous bowling performance. Bowling! Seven! What a performance! Magnificent effort! Best figures in his career. Seven for 98. 
congratulations for a magnificent performance of endurance, courage and spin. That uh, really was a very good delivery there to a tail ender. Drifted it away and then spun it back through the gap. And uh, Joel Garner goes off, assisted by his little mate there. Clean bowl. I think he'll have uh, bowling on his mind rather than batting after that performance. Bruce Shardley, 33 wickets now for Australia this summer. And uh, everybody congratulating him. And I noticed that uh, as he took that wicket, Colin Croft, uh, the batsman down the bowler's end, turned around and congratulated Yardley uh, immediately. So a very good gesture there from the, the West Indian fast bowler. Six for 37 in his last 13 overs did Bruce Yardley, and that's a top performance for a spinner in this country and a great support from his team. Dyson taking two good catches led. But uh, not only a great bowling effort, but one of courage. He wasn't well today and he kept at it, he's bowled. 32 overs, six maidens, seven for 98.